Welcome to the Vogue Archive. The Vogue Archive provides searchable, high-resolution reproductions of every page of American Vogue from 1892 to the present. It's an invaluable resource for fashion students, but it's also useful if you're interested in photography, advertisements, and graphic design. To access the library website from the main CCAD website, scroll to the bottom of the page and click on Packard Library. You can also type CCAD Library in your favorite search engine. Bookmark the site for easy access. From there, go to Research and click on Subject Guides. You can find it in the databases A to Z and under the Majors and Areas of Study. There, it's linked in the Fashion Design, Graphic Design, and Photography Guides. Let's go to the Fashion Design Guide. Click on the Vogue Archive in the menu, then click on the Archive logo. If you're accessing databases from off-campus, you'll need to sign in. Type in your last name, your student ID number that starts with 2CCAD, and click the Sign In button. There's a basic search and an advanced search, and you can also browse issues. Let's try browsing issues. You can choose a decade, a year, a month, and then limit by a specific issue. Let's look at the first advertisement. Hmm, your hat may be smart, but how's your breath today? That's the fun thing about browsing. You never know what you're going to find. At the top right are some tools. You can download the ad as a PDF. You can get a citation if you plan on using it in a paper. You can email it to yourself, or you can print it out. If you click on All Options, you can save your ad into the cloud, export the citation to a citation tool like EasyBib, or save it in a different format. Let's do another search. I'll click on Advanced Search, since it gives us more options. At the top are boxes for search terms, a limiter for publication date, and below that you can search for company or brand, fashion item, photographer or illustrator, and persons pictured. Click Show More Fields to search by designer, material, or trend. You can also limit by document type or document feature. Let's do a search for Revlon lipstick advertisements from the 1950s. I'll add lipstick to the first search box, put in Revlon in the company brand field, select advertisements under document type, and click search. We have plenty of results, but we'll need to narrow it down by date. I'll move the slider so that we only get ads from the 1950s, and then I'll click Update. Let's see what the first result is. It's an ad for a famous color called Cherries in the Snow. You can zoom in, you can zoom out, you can move it around. Just click the X to get out. You have the same options we covered earlier for saving and citations. There's also a Browse This Issue link at the top. If you click on it, you can browse forward and backwards in the issue that your ad appears in. This can be really helpful if you want to see the context of your results. Those are the basics of using the Vogue Archive. If you have questions, visit the library, call us, or email us at library at ccad.edu.